Look at me, 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 look at me now. Fuck, are you kidding me? You're my t Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. gets underway and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Ball slips and then rips. Beautifully done. And they are exchanging leather early. Missed with that attempt. Ooh, head kick Lance was hurt. Lance, uh, Lance in right hand upstairs. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Straight punch lands. Trying the flying knee there. And he landed the right hand there. Block that strike. throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Choi. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Straight right hand now, just misses. Nice one, two there. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Oh, just misses with the kick. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Big ball from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Way to hide that leg kick. Commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. One two punch by the Korean Super Bowl. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Ooh, what a punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. Beautiful kick. Lands a knee there. Nice deception there to get that knee to the target. Really good knee. Nice job of driving it right to the target. Getting it to land. Exactly where you want it. Also, the taller fighter lands in knee yet again. Unable to land with that punch.
doesn't get finished. Very tricky when he throws that body kiss. Final seconds of round one. Five minutes in the books. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint. DC, take us through. High level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round. All right, DC's back from the can as we get this next round underway, and his striking in that previous round was so good. I got tired just watching that. Out. I mean, he did a great job of landing strikes. Not only just punches, not only just strikes, they were significant strikes. A lot of punches outside of the jabs. I've gotten in trouble a lot of times about what's significant and what's not. Right. But I'm telling you, he landed a lot of punches that were very easy to make that determination. Leave the stack guys alone. Leave them alone, man. Over and over, I get in trouble. <laughs> Slips that left hand. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh! Oh, big left hook there! Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of take DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Beautiful straight counter. Joy gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Good punch. Bone on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's gonna put him to sleep. Oh, that could have felt good as he lands the knee to the body. He's a tall fighter and he's gonna have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Overhand left. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Keep your hands up. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Connects with a right. Unable to connect this. Right hook to the head block. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, that's a nice strike. limp there, his leg hurting for certain. Real quick leg kick. Oh, massive head kick there, we'll see if he can finish. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Nice. with the right hand. 
continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. This goes to the body there. Can't take many of those, you better check. Right on the button. Man, how good is his right hook counter? Over and over, he's landing a big body. Ooh! Ten seconds to go in the round. Nice leg kick. Nice punch here. What a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did, he executed. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working, so why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on a highlight reel for the rest of time. Third round underway. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Joy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Try to establish that jab. He loaded up on that right hand, too. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're gonna sit there at the drive-through, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Visibly limping here. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight. And that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Nice, sneaky head kick. Great punch, landed with so much power. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back, it truly makes up the target. Sight to behold. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Punch coming, it's blocked. That's a big strike right there. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Just missed with the elbow there. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the 
the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finish. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Choi. Oh. Serve him up. Go get him. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Good punch lands. Lands a nice one too. Oh, straight right. Joy gets lit up by that straight punch. All right, throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. Blocks the shot. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Oh, he hurt it back in the chest. Continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, that's the end of the round. And our cameraman all over that cut on the cheek. That thing is getting wider by the minute and only getting worse. Cutman going to earn his money tonight. All right, a lot of high-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a... That is it. He got him! What a fight! Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC career. So a big win for him here tonight, and he made an even bigger statement by getting it by TKO. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called us on for this contest at two seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by TKO, Big Daddy!